So I want to show you how to replace the CMOS battery. I'm replacing the CMOS battery because um, the first light and the third light in the front has turned on, blinked for three times with, as well as the amber light on the power button has also blinked three times. So that's indication that the power uh, or the battery uh, could have run out. This computer was sitting in my garage for a few years so there is a high probability that it's been uh, out of power so we need to now try to replace it obviously this is what I bought and so once I remove it I'll take it out from the package you need a tiny screwdriver very small I can see very small and now we need to try to push it back or find a space from the bottom push this carefully so you need to try to push this oh, after a lot of tries it came out so use your hand remove it so this is a new battery take the back end and you can see here now let's just insert inserting from that far end and then putting it in inserting is pretty simple so once again just uh, to remind you this end is where it is kind of kept secure and there is a kind of a gap in between in here you need to push that backwards so it will bend backwards and then here there are two little lips so once it came out of these two little lips you'd lift it a bit up and it should be able to be loose get loose and then you can take it out I hope now you learn how to remove and replace the battery on T3500 I hope this video was useful please don't forget to share and subscribe if you liked it please put a thumbs up again I got a lot of videos on maintaining your computer especially Dell computers this method also can be used for replacing batteries on other Dell PCs I also have a couple of videos for troubleshooting Dell T3500 the errors you could get and the work around around it to be able to resolve each and every problem to get your computer up and running thanks for watching see you next time bye bye